Hello, Frisco ISD. This is the uh, FISD Library Media Services High School Research Resources uh, Genially. So I'm going to kind of show you some of the different things that are on here and how to use this Genially. This video will be right here whenever I get it recorded. Uh, so that's why there's a big blank right there right now. But up here, you'll notice there's the links to um, FISD uh, library media services on the internet, uh, on the web, and then there is a link to various uh, helpful videos for FISD library and media services here. Um, you can go to our Twitter, you can um, access email, and then this is the FISD phone number here, the general number for FISD. Also, um, so down here there are some helpful things. We're going to be talking about Mac and Via, which is where all of our research resources live. So there is a free app that you can put on your phone. Also, your campus library websites are going to have additional information besides just the information we're going to talk about here. Um, so make sure you check out your campus library website. Um, and then if you need help, you're going to contact your campus librarian and there's a list of the campus librarians here. So I'm going to start off with this research rubric link right here. I'm going to click on this and you'll notice that this is going to open up to a PDF of a uh, rubric that is intended for uh, high school, but that can be used by teachers. It can be used as students uh, to guide you as you are researching. But this is um, a rubric that was developed uh, by FISD for the purposes of assessing research. So you'll notice over here, we've got the different um, areas that you can be um, assessed on and then if your um, you know if your work is exemplary proficient emerging or if it's not there yet uh, so that rubric is there and um, teachers you can also access this rubric is eventually going to be built into canvas so you can add it directly to canvas assignments as well all right so um, we are going to start with this link right here if you click on this link it is going to open to um, a series of slides that are information about um, how to use uh, the research resources provided by FISD and also I talk about those slides in detail in um, this this video right here this video so in order to access um, any of our research resources, you're going to need to log into Mac and Via. And so I show you how to log into Mac and Via, how to access the different resources, and I kind of walk you through why these are really great resources for research um, and et cetera. This is a link to the document that I talk about in that video using um, the different the different types of resources that are in Mac and Via. So again, I talk about that document here in this video. Over here, uh, a big thing with research is academic ethics and using sources with academic integrity. So this, this document right here talks about FISD academic ethics and how to use the different resources um, within this as well as in Mac and Via with academic integrity. If you click on either one of these, I'm gonna click on the MLA one here. You'll notice that this is going to prompt uh, students or teachers to make a, a copy of this. And so this is a, a research notes paraphrasing tool or cited uh, template that students and teachers can use. And if you click this use template button, it is going to um, ask you to, it's going to make a copy of this document and put it in your Google Drive. Um, so you can see right there, that is the document. Um, and then, like I said, there's one for MLA and there's one for APA as well. And then this video right here talks about how to use all three of these links here. And then over here, because oftentimes students uh, or teachers are using images um, uh, separately from uh from information and so here we have a, a, a document that will give you information about how what sources have images in Mac and Via and then how to um, cite certain types of images from Mac and Via and then how to find a Creative Commons license to zero images if you need those as well. Um, and then this video right here details all about um, images that um, you can that you can uh, use 
uh, for academic purposes here at school. So I hope that this video about all the different things um, on here have been helpful to you. You'll notice this little guy right here. If you click on this, it is going to show you where all the different links are. Um, so anything that has that lights up there is going to have a link that you can use. And so we hope that you have found this video uh, helpful in using this resource. And if you have any questions or you need anything, um, your campus librarians or your information experts, and they are ready and willing to help you and excited to help you do any research. So please reach out to them and they will be happy to provide you with any assistance that you need.